It's already foggy in a few locations. We have warmer air that's starting to move in over the cooler air mass that's been in place for the last couple of days, and that's causing some fog. We also have some lingering showers. Now, the heavy rain from earlier today is gone. Uh, what's left, low clouds and showers, still can't rule out a few rumbles of thunder overnight as that warmer air continues to move our way. This is a local view of some of the light rain that is falling uh, around the Indianapolis area and south near Trafalgar and Johnson County. We have a few lingering showers into Lawrence approaching Greenfield. This activity will continue overnight, and it's the reason you're going to need to keep the umbrella handy during the day tomorrow. We still have a few showers across the southern sections of Hamilton County and then back to around Pike County. Township and Speedway. We will keep a close eye on live Doppler 13 radar overnight. We will also be watching closely the visibilities. We're up a bit from last check to four miles in Indianapolis, but we're down a bit in Lafayette. Current visibility is two miles. We expect the ups and downs, and you can see the low cloud deck from our camera downtown. 49 degrees right now. Winds are south southeast at eight. 49 is our new high temperature, a sign that, yes, the numbers are starting to climb. We picked up 0.79 inches of rain officially in Indianapolis, over 8 tenths in uh, Rush County, also almost near 9 tenths in Shelbyville, just over 3 quarters of an inch of rain, and Muncie just under that in Bloomington. Heavy rain is gone, you can see, as it moved across central Indiana during the evening hours. What's left behind, the low clouds, the showers, the drizzle, and, yes, the fog, and we keep that in the forecast. Those will be the weather issues during the day on Thursday. Temperatures will climb by 8 a.m. We're at 58, 60 degrees by noon. High temperatures tomorrow in the mid-60s, but it's going to be pretty gray most of the day with the low clouds fog continuing. Future Track 13 shows the chance for showers through tomorrow evening. We'll have another round of rain, maybe a few rumbles of thunder later Thursday night into early Friday as this weather system passes to our south. The good news, as it moves south, we may actually end. Friday with a little bit of sunshine. Next couple of days look pretty soggy, especially tomorrow. Showers, fog, maybe a few rumbles of thunder Thursday night into early Friday. We will end Friday with a little bit of sunshine, 60. Right now we'll be dodging rain both Saturday and Sunday. If you're running the Monumental Marathon, temperatures will be in the upper 40s and low 50s to start. We are forecasting 60 on Saturday, 70 with a, perhaps another round of some thunderstorms on Sunday.